guys, and welcome back to another episode of Tactical Talks. So, I'm not a huge fan of clickbait, but in me putting, I'm selling all my guns. That's obviously not true for anybody who knows me. I am selling a gun that I'm going to be showing you guys here in a minute. But what I really want to talk about was people doing this what's in your safe um, videos. It, it's kind of funny. It, it's, well, before I get into the why I think it's funny, um... It's interesting to watch other people's videos and to watch the videos that uh, people put out as far as what kind of guns they have, why they have those guns, um, the different builds that people have done, the rare guns that people have, the reasoning behind them, things that have been handed down. I watch so many videos of so many different guns and you guys give, have given me so many ideas of like, well now I need this or now I need that or some guns that I never realized that I really wanted until I watched some of these videos. but. I'm watching these videos and I was thinking to myself like some of these people in these videos and I'm gonna poke fun at somebody real quick my fellow youtuber my buddy Ant Diesel really quick shout out to Ant Diesel if you guys don't know who that is go and check him out I'm gonna leave him a link down below but Ant Diesel is a very you know uh, what's the word I'm looking for he's a very blunt person he don't hold nothing back if you feel some type of way about something he'll let you know and it's funny because in the video, he even jokes around and he's like, well, I don't have this one no more. This one disappeared in the woods. A bear ate this one. He says all these things. And I mean, he had me laughing. I was cracking up when he was saying all these things. But I was like, man, he was the last one or one of the last ones that I would have thought who would be putting out all his information. Not, not information like personal stuff, but like putting out, I have this gun and this gun and this gun. Because I got to thinking and I'm like, man, I have some things that, that you guys haven't even seen yet that's in my safe. I have some things coming that you guys don't even know about. Um, and, and not because I don't want you to know or not because they're illegal, but I don't need everybody knowing all of my business. I pick certain guns that I'm going to make videos on, certain guns that I talk about, certain things that I think are relevant. And those are the things that I talk about, certain builds, different things like that. But I trade and sell every now and then. And, you know, there's some of those guns that you guys don't see. But when I started watching these videos and people saying, I have this gun and this gun and this gun, it just made me laugh. I'm like, some of these people, um, and I'm not talking about anybody in particular, but some of these people have this like, well, they're out to get me. Um, and there could be anybody. You know, I'm not talking about any, any group or any people or any person specifically. But some people have the mindset of, well, they're out to get me. They want to know what I have. They're trying to come take my guns. They're trying to do this. They're trying to do that. Trying to do this. And it's like, if you don't know what I have, then you can't come and take it. You know, and that's that's my thinking. Um, there's a lot of videos of guns that I do have that, again, there's nothing wrong with them. Not illegal or nothing. But I guess if you really wanted to come and get them, at least you know about those. But it was just funny to me that people were talking about, I have this, 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 and this. And then you could watch some of their videos and they were like, well... I don't want anybody knowing what I have. So it was kind of a funny trend. I got to thinking like, and I'm not a conspiracy theorist by any means. I'm not somebody who thinks that somebody's out to get me or anybody's trying to come and take my guns. But if I was, I got to thinking like, what if somebody who wanted to know what I had was the first person to put out a video or told somebody else, hey, you should make a video about all the guns that you have. Make it a challenge. And see if it catches on and we'll find out what all these people have. Maybe I'm just thinking too far into it. But no, that had me laughing. But in all reality, um, I'm going to be selling a Glock 27. This is it right here. So for all you safety freaks, there's not a magazine inserted right now. The holster that is on it is a very tight fitting holster. When you're wearing it, it comes out nice and easy. When you're not, it is a little bit difficult to get off of there. It's got a threaded barrel and it's got a few other things, um, upgrades and stuff. I've done videos in the past. So if you guys want to learn more about this gun, um, go search those videos and check them out. But the reason I'm selling this gun, um, I was a huge 40, you know, uh, caliber person. Not so much anymore. I don't have anything against the round. I don't hate the round. I mean, it, it, it's a good round. It does everything I've needed it to do. And it has for years. But like I talked about here recently, Ballistics have changed so much in the last couple of years that the difference between a 9 and a 40 are not significant enough for me to to need a 40 or really want a 40 over a 9mm. Um, so I am moving over to more 9mm 
and I have a couple of 40s still that I will keep, but I don't need all of them. So like I said, I do sell and trade guns. Um, I am going to get rid of this gun no matter what, but I figured I would put this information out there to you guys <coughs> to see if any of my viewers um, wanted this gun before I put it out there to anybody else. Um, I'm not going to say the price that I'm looking for right now, but I am going to be giving it away or selling it, not giving it away. For a reasonable price, I'm trying to, you know, not get rich off the deal, but at least get some money back for what I know it's worth, um, especially with all the upgrades that are in it, all the extra parts that you guys are going to be getting. Now, some of these things are going to be coming off. However, the gun as a whole, you are going to be getting your money's worth if you buy this. If not, I have a couple people lined up um, here locally that are talking about wanting to get this or uh, me selling it too so that I can buy something else. At work, I carry a Glock 22. So this is the baby brother for the Glock 22, and I've done videos about that in the past, about carrying a smaller version of you know your, your main gun that used the same magazine, stuff like that, and why I feel that that's important. But I'm not gonna be carrying that Glock 22 for very much longer. Um, my department is moving over to SIGs, uh, P320s, I'm getting nine millimeter version, and um, I just really don't have a use for a backup 40 if I'm not going to be carrying a primary 40 and like I said I already have other 40s and there's nothing wrong with this gun I've used this gun for a long while I got it from a good buddy of mine and this thing has done everything I've needed it to I've like I said multiple upgrades to this thing and uh, I couldn't be happier with it I just know that once I stop using that Glock 22 that I'm not gonna have a need for this gun it's just gonna sit in a safe so I figure, why not get it to somebody who could actually use it, somebody who actually wants it, or maybe just somebody who wants something different. So by no means am I selling this on here. I don't want YouTube to get mad at me. I'm just telling you guys that I am selling a gun. If you decide that you want to message me, um, email me, whatever the case is, then at that point, we can have a conversation outside of YouTube. I'm not selling a gun on YouTube. We can have a conversation outside of that whole situation and we'll figure it out from there. Um, my email address, for whatever reason, every time I link it down below or I put it in the comment section, you guys want to reach out to me, it gets removed, deleted. I don't know if YouTube um, has a policy against it. I'm not real big into reading all the policies. I'm not sure if they don't like it. I don't know. But it's jlv86yt at gmail.com. So if you guys are interested in something I may or may not be selling, send me an email and we'll figure out the logistics of it to see about getting it to you. Now, this is going to be done 100% legally, um, selling this outside of YouTube. On top of that, going through an FFL and background checks and all those things. So if you're not at least 18 years or older or however old you have to be in your state, this is all going to be... Um, USA only unfortunately so for any of my viewers who are not in the United States I'm sorry this is not going to apply to you but this is going to be USA based and whatever age you have to be for your state you're going to have to meet those qualifications you're going to have to pass a background check and all that kind of thing in order to get your hands on this thing but I just don't have a real need for it um, if you guys have any other questions any recommendations about what I should do next comment down below let me know hopefully we have some more videos coming out and uh, like I said, I got some big things happening, so just stick around and check it out. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you on the next one.